was good. Um, I never had an exact way of how I wanted to do this because typically at the end of the day, I have like 13 different ways I want to do anything. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try this several different ways. I'm sure I'll mix it up and the final product hopefully will be nice. So what I'm talking about now is a code. Yesterday I played a story that said code of conduct. It's pretty much something that you follow. Um, your beliefs, whatever it is, it's a, it's a code you're not supposed to break. If you break the code, there will be repercussions. So Tupac had a code for thug life. And when I was into my rhyming, my poems, trying to do spoken word, etc., I was pumping the unity. And so I was like, if I'm going to pump this thing called the unity, I need to have a code as well. So I started to write a code. Uh, it's obviously not complete, but I, I wrote a good foundation to start with. And I saved it on my phone. I emailed it to myself just to keep a record of it. And obviously it's been sitting in the archives for a minute. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to read that entire code. Um, pretty much word for word. Put it on YouTube. Let's see how it goes. So first thing I wrote was, if when available, adv- advice slash guidance should be given to anyone that wants to be in your position. And then in parentheses I wrote, can you imagine where we would be with our people risen. Um, so especially if you're in a position of power, the smallest thing for being a homeowner, you know what I mean? Like we want to own property, we want to own shit. Uh, being a homeowner, being a business owner, um, even if you're a boss for your, for your job, you know what I mean? Like there's certain things, there's certain do's and don'ts we should be doing in the workplace. Um, there's tips and tricks you can give to help people, uh, you know, exceed and become successful. So, not to say that's rule number one, but that's the first thing I wrote. If, when available, advice slash guidance should be given to someone that wants to be in your position. Um, my position, I ain't nobody special, but I can tell you exactly where I was the last time my bank account went negative. Uh, I can tell you how I started to save money. Uh, I can tell you how I got my credit to where it's at now. My credit is over 800 in case if you're curious. It's not like it fucking matters these days. But there's certain things that I've done, me, without asking for help, without needing anything else, and this is how I got to where I am. I can tell you what I did. I can tell you how I got down to 157 pounds. Um, I can tell you how I deadlifted 585 pounds. And regardless of what it is, you might not have the same uh, options I did when it came time to save money and things like that. But for number one, you know what's possible. And number two, if you don't have the same options I do, you can figure out what you do have and see if you can make it happen. And that's the biggest thing. LeBron James can tell you how he balls all day long. I want to say Kobe because that's my dude, but unfortunately he's not here, so I'm using LeBron. But at the end of the day, if he told you, I'm going to use Kobe, I can't. I'm sorry, LeBron. Nothing but love, man, but Kobe. If Kobe told you how to shoot, how to dribble, uh, what to look for. And he told you every single thing he does, when he wakes up, what he eats, all that, like the route he takes to go to work. And you're like, cool, I'm going to do the exact same thing. You're not going to be exactly like Kobe. You might have that inner Kobe inside you and this and that and this. But it's not always the same. So that's when like, okay, so what you do when you release the ball is blah, 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 blah. You might say, you know what? I'm going to use that but because I'm not as tall, I'm going to try to do this instead with my legs. You know, and you put your mix on it, put your spin on it, and then hopefully something can happen. But that's the biggest thing is, is helping each other out. You know, reach out that hand so a motherfucker can grab it if they're trying to, you know, pull themselves up and do something. Um, it's the best way to put it. I see what I did now was I just read, I didn't even read it. I stated the first thing of the code, and then I talked about it, and I like that. So I might watch this tomorrow and see if I like it and just post it. And if that's the case, I'll do the same thing with the next line of the code, and I'll go so on and so on and so on. We'll just see what happens. I'm out, though, man. I gotta get out of here.